yo 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 is banger here and this is the 7 artisans 35 mil t 2.1 silence big thanks to 7 artisans for sending me this piece for testing what you just saw was a film was a short film entirely taken with this a really great piece of metal and glass and some other elements like plastic so the entire short film was taken only with this 35 mil and the idea for for this short film was uh, kind of basic i wanted to show you guys something different than just myself talking to you from the very beginning and uh, i wanted you to feel what i felt uh, while using this lens for these specific scenes and maybe let me know in the comments what you think about the short film from the beginning i would like to hear some of your thoughts and ideas uh, did you like it? Did you like the story? Did you like the, the footage? I wanted the shots to be slow and deliberate so you can see all the details and nuances uh, related to the specs of this 35mm uh, sign lens. From a user perspective, it is a fully manual lens and I didn't have any rig or even a follow focus so I like operate entirely manually using my fingers so uh, it wasn't hard to be honest it, it is a really nice lens you can feel the rings it's easy to maintain the focus uh, throughout the whole scene so that's a, that's a great thing the ring works really smooth and it's you can really feel it the large aperture of t 2.1 works really well with close objects i'm sure you notice these uh, sequences where the background was really nicely uh, blurred. Uh, the bokeh is really smooth and, and tasty. So I'm sure you saw that. The entire thing is uh, super lightweight. It weighs only 602 grams. Uh, it's perfect for any kind of handheld shooting. The price range of this standard sign lens is only $369. And what's more, there are many, many different packages you can get this lens in. So go to the 7 Artisan store and see the packages by yourself. You have two with three pieces with three lenses available and one with six lenses available and a bunch of cool stuff around that with the toolbox and stuff. So that would be the perfect starting point for anyone who's looking for a standard sign lens. So let me know in the comments what you think and I think this is it guys. Thanks for watching and I see you in the next one.